No, today. There. Uh, and uh, I thought it was interesting. I could yeah. I had I wrote up a bunch of comments, right? Yeah. And yeah. now I was going through making a lot more comments. So it's really so I don't want to be rude to him my back, but even my knees. Well, up against the wall, you know, legs there, <laughs> just white angle, but that's yeah. not better. I just, I just can't do it. No, the legs are not going to be my idea. Yeah. Uh, we're going to talk about that. Uh, next week, uh, the next week, we're going to talk about that. 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 But I, 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 I wrote up some things that, uh, that I'm going to. And I think a little bit about some of these, this is, and you probably got more, things, but some of these uh, um, questions about the maintenance person, but also about what needs to be done. So those those are some of the uh, issues. But there's probably many more, but uh, um, I think, you know, getting a list of things to be done um, and get some clarity about what, what the job is and what you're doing, when and where and how. Well, we had that. Um, it was a spreadsheet. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but that spreadsheet, we used it. Yeah. And it's, it's something. Well, you know, going way, way back a number of years, it's more uh, loose that you go back then. Yeah. We developed a spreadsheet of all the activities in town. Yeah. That we consider remains. And yeah. it's been somewhat updated. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you know that. So you say, what tasks have we done during the months after? I think it's bad enough to be bad. The task we worked through there, and I was listed daily, monthly, um, summertime. I didn't see the summer, the winter time stuff. I saw the, the daily thing, and I saw the day to day thing. I don't think it's that bad, but my concern is what. Um, what happens to you between November and May? You know, because that's a different schedule again. And, uh, and and those are the extra kind of things that need to be done. And that's why this is some of the ones that I saw. And there's probably other ones too, but I, uh, I just think those are those can be done uh with all the all the particularly in the winter, you know, the mulch piles and, and veins and uh, uh you know, when you met you have a lot of last time, so you have a lot of time. So. The last you know, couple of months of the year and a couple, a couple of months before, no vote takes a bit. So we, that's still, you know, it doesn't really take much. <laughs> I guess it doesn't, but it's, it, it takes some time. But these things are projects. Um, but anyway, that, those are, we're going to be talking, continue talking about that. But they, uh, um, what, what, where is your status with well, the town council? I, don't think status is. I think that it's been kicked out of the room for a long time. I don't think there's any going on. Um, from that, that's, um, but I think, uh, you, know, you know, you've been involved and Alex has been involved. So I think Alex has to be like way to do it. Well, Alex is like, you know. The, the town council representative, which I think is wonderful that we found them. You know, yeah. Take it from this to the town council. Yeah. The question is, I guess, more of you know where things are with yeah. what Alex is seeing and yeah. is that satisfactory yeah, to the town problem. council? And and you know, I, I can you know I'm still not you know yeah. you know real with it you well, know, at all. Right. But I, I need to step back because I'm too. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, you know, I, I say step back. Yeah. I mean, I think the town council is what I've said from day one that yeah. that needs to take. Um, I agree. I agree. Yeah, I, I, I don't know how you can be frustrated about them. I mean, you can have to the ones that make the decisions on well, what that is. Everybody, that's the that I don't want to do. I don't want to do that. I can't do I mean, no decision or no documentation is the decision of what, what has been done. And, yeah. and, you know, it does take, it does take um, time and it does take, um, 
and then he and at this point. But to me, it's 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 you know I've said before, and to a lot of people not liking it, but if, if you can't do the basics with the town, um, you know, it, to some degree, what Javier does or what the bookkeeper does, I mean, it it it, it, it takes away from what they do. Yeah. And I agree. Um, I don't think there's anything we really can do. No, it has to do with the great so it's all, you know, you know, it's a lot of high control. I want anything to think of is, is again, it comes down to Javier basically um, managing authority. And uh, you know, I think you, that the town council wants to make the expectations. It's really, or, I mean, Alex on the, Council should not actually be doing that. I agree. I agree. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I mean, but that was council. Council stop that. It was the yeah, short term. Stop term. The yeah. council sets policy. Could come up with a list of things for when they do, but it's it's the whole responsibility to to stand and make sure that it occurs. I think Alex was trying to understand what he yeah. was doing. Right. Yeah, and, and so I thought that was a necessary step to follow uh, along and try to learn and understand what the nature of the job was, which I think that's what well, he, I don't have a problem with that. Yeah. that. That's what he was doing. Well, and I think the next step is I mean, for the I mean, I, to be very clear to what the expectations are. To me, there's only so much bill that. Yeah, know, the government services right. can do. Yeah, it, 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 I, I mean, I, I mean, I mean, you've already addressed it many times. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I agree. I mean, you know, we, you know, I mean, just, to, I mean, just talk about. I was walking across, and I know we had the um, the um, uh, signage there. You know, that's still nothing's on that. And I, and I know, uh, you know, I know that not may not be may not be maintenance okay i mean in all fairness yeah. but that's one of those things that yeah. you know when you're when you sort of a team concept what you what you what you see is whoops there's something that's missing you know we need to get on that yeah. maybe that is something that is an important wintertime project if that's where they're doing nothing maybe it's something is created and put that i, I don't know yeah, yeah. That, is, that should be but, but those, those things are going to be the uh, part of the record we're going to start that and we're going to be some rules and get some apps and things like that but you're right, those things. Yeah, but it's more of seeing it right. and saying, hey, yeah. somebody needs to be doing this and and, and putting it in fruition. Mm -hmm. And you know, to me, it's just obvious that what I continue to see is maintenance is not something that is important for the town of Stockville. Um, well, and I also think, too, like even with the uh, chaos that was put up by surprise, the first thing everyone mentioned is there needs to be water sealed and effective that still hasn't happened and we're all the city. Then fading and shifting and the seats being bumped by noise and stuff like that too. And at the comprehensive plan on Saturday, and I don't remember what it specifically was for. I um, mean, you know, some of the business is kind of broken out. Um, what they were talking about is the growth area. There's many growth areas in the town. If you get into each and every one of those growth areas, the lack of maintenance affects that. You know, we talk about increasing the growing tourism. The lack of maintenance affects that. You want to talk about, you know, um, Airbnbs and stuff. The lack of maintenance uh, does that. You want to talk about events. The lack of maintenance does that. So it's like it was really interesting. Even when they broke it out, instead of saying, "Well, you know, if I say growth, people might think just houses," but everything when you really look at it, every area we're talking about, we need to grow it. The, the 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 maintenance is the key to it. But I thought it was interesting too, is we have council person there. And I was bringing up the same point that you do is look, we need to go back and take care of the bases. We can't build, you know, on a, you have to have solid base. And uh, they didn't agree with that. So I find that a little bit tough. And that's, I think, Kevin saying the direction of council is no matter what, even if you're pushing the comprehensive plan and you're pushing growth and everything else, if we can't maintain the sidewalk, if we don't have public safety, if we don't take care of what we have, and it looks fair, terrible or it doesn't, whatever. It's perceived that the town isn't doing well or doesn't care. This affects all our, our abilities to grow. And I thought it was a little interesting that one of the, 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 the town council members didn't agree with that. 
I felt that we could we can still grow here and we can worry about that later. And I don't think that's true. I think you have to pull back, just like Kevin says. I'm not trying to take your time, no, 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 just no. like you said, I think we've got to get a solid base before we start growing. I don't think there's anything else we can do. Well, is there any uh, recommendation or action for, for just to pass it? I mean, I think it's the same thing we said before. Oh, that, uh, okay. It's really Javier. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm listening. Javier, if you want it, I'll send that to the Pat House. Mm -hmm. It's really, you know, I mean, do you have nice to that? Yeah, yeah. 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 you can have that to the Pat House, but I mean, these are. Issues like that, that, that. You had the list, and uh, I assume you had the list down there. We got all yeah, the spreadsheet the list the, list the, the, the week tomorrow spreadsheet that you had our conversation. Yeah, you had that. Uh, but this is a special editor here with yeah, well, let's say <laughs> in you know, the the year, you can't get the regular year. I mean, I understand what you're saying. It's just, yeah. I mean, I'm just looking for some basics. I mean, you know, yeah. you can't grow. I mean, some of that stuff, you know, you don't do the mowing, but looking at the streets and the parking areas and cleaning up, yeah, that's doesn't matter what time of the year you're at. Mm -hmm. It could take them a week just to paint all the white lines properly in the parking lot. And they're all, they all need to be done because last yeah. time they were barely done. You mm -hmm. take, it should be a day's job if it is. I'm just saying, if you wanted to, you know, because you need to get a roll, you don't need to just go, Psh, and then it's just because. No, I didn't realize that. You didn't know. mean a roll in the white paint. Right. Anyway, what's going on? The web page. I spent about an hour today looking through the web page. Mm -hmm. I thought it was a really good start. But it really has a lot of details and things like that that need to be fixed. Definitely. I, um, I mean, yeah, I, I, mean, I, I started just simple things like, um, I'll just give you an example maps. There, um, yeah. there are actually maps on there, but yeah. there's not a button that says maps. Yeah, you can't find it. You can't I, find I, it. I agree. There's a lot of um, things hurt. I, uh, there's Another map, you want maps of not only the river map, but you want parking maps. And there was a comment about parking, and yeah. you want a map of yeah. parking and for that a lot. There's historical overlay. Yeah. I need to map of that. Or the entrance corner, what speaks on that. That you know, yeah. reset. I mean, just stuff like that. Um and so the maps were coming up under. Places I wouldn't expect it, like yeah. government budget, finance, yeah, I mean, and business development. Yeah. I mean, you I could see a map under business development that said these are the development areas. Um, you know, so I I envisioned four, five, six different maps for the town. I think so. Be, what? Yeah, I agree. I we must have some we're all shots out there. So you know, you, you can do, you know, you can do. Commercial area, development area, historical overlay, entrance corridor, you know, just overlays. I mean, so like when you look at Google Maps on your phone, they have overlays. Well, you know, one map and five overlays or six overlays. Well, that's probably the easiest way to do it. But, you know, I can see that. Um, so that was, you know, just I went through. Um, we'll get a whole bunch of things. Um, did find one thing really interesting. There's a place there that mentions James River and supposedly a link to Hatton Ferry that goes to a Chinese website. <laughs> really? went, went that way two or three times, different, different places. Really? Yes. I don't know what the hell that Chinese website is, but I can't look. They all look Chinese to me. I don't think that a lot. So I don't know if it's worth us sitting here yeah. without sit somebody who's actually doing it and sit there and almost have to look at page and menus, every one of them. I agree. Yeah, I mean, I've been going through it myself. And one of the things I don't like to do is have words that are how to. I'll resume the meeting. I think that you can do this. So, I don't know how to do this. 
But it leaves a lot of work. Let me check that. I almost like to go. I had a hard time finding the minutes. Well, I, I noticed something on there. Um, there were minutes, agendas, but not of all the committees. So the yeah. committees, the minutes of a, and this committee was not on calendar. Well, I was going to say too, I think my understanding when we hired them was that the website would be searchable. And my understanding of that was that if I punched in yeah. map, I could find every map. If I punched in the word sidewalk, I could find everything that the sidewalk is listed in. And what it appears to me, just from briefly going through it, is that if we can't find exactly what you want, then it takes you into Google to find it. So like if I say how to Zoom, it, even though Zoom is mentioned quite a few times on our website, it takes me to a Google search or, or a match of how do you Zoom. It has nothing to do with our website. Yeah. So it seems it just constantly takes you out of the website. And my understanding was our website was going to be searchable, not that people could now go to the internet and take it off our website. That makes yeah. no sense to me. I kind of have a problem with that. Yeah, I'm supporting the research. Really great. Uh, some of it's, I don't know how to edit it. Some of it's not long enough. Uh, as well as it's editing. Right, like still have council members that are no longer active if they still have. Like I don't know, today, just for the government service, or the government service, it doesn't have any of this government service number, I think. It's not even this. Well, that's what you guys are with the agent. Yeah, and he did that. He did that. He did that. He did a couple of typos someplace. I don't know how to do that. I'm going to get it. I don't know how to see if I can do some of that in a second. The problem is, is we don't have anybody expertise to do this. Yeah. Well, technically, it's the clerk's responsibility. That's yeah. Like another one of those. Yeah. Once everyone's trained, we'll get to it maybe next year kind of thing. Yeah. yeah they hire, you hire them. Right? And a clerk, right. When is she starting? She's starting. That's her. Yeah. She's not a little while back. Oh, okay. Yeah. I think she could do it. She's got to be able to do the website. Oh, okay. um, so, I mean, I looked at it and said, without somebody seeing me actually doing it, yeah. I can come up with a list of pages and stuff to do. Yeah. You know, and I didn't see where that was going to end. So, no. Yeah. Right. Well, yeah, I guess we get, we're kicking it around. The, the concept is the website got migrated for the most part, and now now the work begins. Yes. And I almost feel like it's been migrated and, you know, it's done. It kind of looks to me like the same old website. Yeah. Well, a lot of that, I think, has to be done by somebody who just starts off. Yeah. Uh, not. Uh, that company could help, but somebody has to actually, I mean, uh, sit there, go through it and find the documents and put them on there and stuff like that. They're not going to be able to find it. Yeah, yeah I, I don't know if, because they just migrated it, when you do a search, it pulls you out because that's just the default. But to do it within, can you do it within the pages and then someone would have to go in and tag it? Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if that's actually something they can do. So we need to find that out. Because just pulling me out, like you said, through Chinese dark side isn't going to help me in um, So, you know, I don't know. I mean, I agree with you. When I was working, when we made key documents, we had to come up with all the keywords. Right. And we had a whole bunch of keywords in them. And that was what was used in searches. Right. Um, in publishing, you call that a finding rule. Okay. Same concept. Same concept. Yeah. yeah. But someone has to then select yeah. that and you have to mark <laughs> yeah, we have We have a publisher who came back and then marked each one of those settings. After we said these are the key words, they, they do a word search and mark every one of them. Right. That's what I'm saying. There's a lot more to it. Yeah. Yeah. But again, I don't know if you have that. If our, New website actually yeah. has it. Really or is it? Yes, it has it, just no one has done it yet. Yeah, you know, I, I don't know. Well, no, there's much else that we need. So, this other question is just 
that it didn't seem to me well uh once ago and uh and we looked at this it's about a committee but uh, I talked to some people about it and I'm not sure what uh committee would be included. Um so, but it's a uh, emergency preparedness committee and, and uh, I think I think it would fall under under public safety. I mean it's over overly I mean, overly complicated I think but uh, I read, went through it, but I think that that is going to be involved with that point. That's well. Yeah. So I mean, if you want to make a comment, but that that was, um, I don't know if you could be a separate committee, but I, I think you ought to stuck with the one that's uh, got a lot to it. But uh, I'd rather have other committees for that as part of our guy. Future Safety Committee or a Financial Committee or a, or a Advanced Committee. We talked about that. That's a good, you know, this is committee. Like, I think it's because that one guy, the one uh, guy is really involved in this and, uh, you know, trying to get him involved, keep him involved. I think he be involved in public safety. I agree. I think it, my personal advice, I think, would be public safety. Yeah. It's something that is extremely important. Yeah. Um, it isn't part of public safety. Yeah. Are you so so no, 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 no. And I don't think that it's so hard to get volunteers or anything. Because we don't do the basic. Do. That doctor, they want to be uh, put some work or something too. Well, I was going to say, when you get into the public safety, that's part of this committee. That's one the reason they was here. Everyone that's going to be affected in this, yeah. your police department, your fire department, your yeah. EMD, whatever, yeah. they're already going to be yeah. here. Yeah. You know, there's a connection here. Yeah. And then to then create another meeting that they all technically would have to be involved in or connected to or whatever. It seems like a lot of work for, for, volunteers. for, for the other people. But, you know, I think I, I think it should be on the public, public safety. It makes sense. And I don't think it needs to be that yeah. complicated, yeah. I think it needs to be a general point that it's a, you know, that what yeah. is it, public awareness? Yeah, that's, it, uh, that's uh, why I thought it should. What, what I asked her to send it. Who, who is, I mean, who, who came up with I, that? Okay. And, uh, I asked her to send it, but she didn't get it. I mean, I think it's taken care of that. I think it might be affected. That's basically what it's about. Mm -hmm. it's, it's about uh, it seems to me it's an important public safety. Um, I agree. And that, and, you know, it's emergencies are, you know, they already do something. So it needs to be just, you know, they have to have yearly practices and, and stuff like that. And, you know, it's the way it needs to periodically look to make sure that emergency procedures are up to date. And uh, yeah. is there anything else that needs to be added? Yeah, I mean, there's a lot to it. There's a lot of, I mean, there's a lot of, there's a lot of, there's a lot of, the biggest one here is blood, but you know, you yeah. can have a place, but they got me a problem. Yeah. Or they can take fire, fire, right. hurricane, right. Um, with not the flooding as much as you put on um, damaged trees and right. stuff like that. Look at the audience and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But these these are all things like you know, if you talk about like school shootings and stuff, these are all things that these agencies are already trained for one and so that's right. And to have it in our file, I guess, yes. is um you're doing your you know your due diligence, but yeah. it's still not gonna change the way the police department yeah. is gonna react to it. But I do think there's certain things in there she's probably talking more about like who do we contact if this happens? How do people know if there's a problem? Yeah. And et cetera. I mean, these are different things that, yeah. even though they, they have it, it'd be good to know. Do you know what I mean? And I thought that's website. what the website was yeah. going to be doing. Yeah. That was going to be one of the points of the website. You know, if we're out of power, here's the connection to whatever the power company is. If we're dealing with down trees and this is who we would report it to, which really is not the Scottsdale, but in those services. And I thought that was going to be part yeah. of the website. I don't really see that we need to have another committee and more yeah. meetings. Um, and I think the very people you should probably be asking is, 
the volunteer fire department, police department, mm -hmm. you know, emergency response, yeah. whether or not they want another committee and more meetings. And so yeah. But I do think there are, there are valid things that yeah. we don't have that would be better to serve yeah. public safety without a doubt. I mean, most, if they have policies and procedures, they can be brought to us or put on the website. I think it's more the connection. Yeah. You know, when something goes bad, who we talk to, you know. <clears throat> oh, we have 500, 600, 700 people in the town. I mean, when we have so many committees, yeah, I just had to get diluted. I mean, you know, I, 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 I'm I'm being on it about town maintenance, but I'm telling you, right, it doesn't take a rocket science to see if you can't get maintenance. Yeah. All this other stuff. I mean, if you, I mean, did you expect the website to be something different? Did you? Did you? I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I, didn't. I, didn't. Yeah. I mean, no, no, no. But why, why would I? Why would a common sense person see maintenance the way it is? Other than we got a grant, we had somebody got that we paid to do it. Okay, but the idea of expecting it to be something and not needing local wise help. I mean, somebody's going to have to go in there and do it. But I, I, I just, I mean, there's a lot of things that. <laughs> you, you gain traction with getting something done and then it goes to the next level but i just think this is i mean i, I would be great if we were at that stage yeah, i'm just yeah, you're right but I, I, never really followed through the uh, middle just like we had this conference uh, and had all the meetings but it's pretty much smaller than the people that were came to each and sometimes the same people no. People, people, people are, people people are, are people. passionate about their passion. I mean, that's usually what it, it drives them. But, but to do that, I just, I, I don't know, I keep coming back to the maintenance. And I know we've done that and through that. But I mean, you know, again, um, it comes back to the standpoint of we got to start with getting something right first. Yeah. And then, I, and again, I, do you have any thoughts on the website, um, Javier, as far as? I mean, the clerk, I mean, is, is that something that she can yeah. bring up the speed on? And when would that be able to take place? And Yeah, I thought the most productive maybe would be for you in some kind of way between government services to have a list of either edits. Yeah. And then either yeah. I can subdivide it. I know Bill offered to provide some time. Yeah, I'm going to try to do some of it. Is it the time that was the, with the uh, company that was creating it? Is that... Yeah, um, like we're now into like the what is it? Not it being created, but it being managed okay. phase. So like I got passed on to a new person that for the maintenance of it. So editing it would be us at this point mm -hmm. and changing it. Have you guys tried to search on it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know, but what a few sections I saw that I don't know how to do it, but it's how to add a button. Mm -hmm. You know, add buttons and, and change. I just want to edit it. And it makes things correct and, mm -hmm. and accurate. That's what I'm looking at, you know, just make sure everything says what it's supposed to be said, you know, the correct members around there and the correct times and the correct spelling and stuff. Like that. But as far as adding buttons, I don't know, I don't know how to do that. I don't know that. I know how to edit it. Yeah. 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 There's a staff member I could reach out and then yeah. I showed you that training. Yeah. That I gotta go through also. Um, yeah. There's probably some how to do on there. Yeah, I mean, and the look of it is okay, but I think some announcements to be more front and center too. Or, 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 like I said, if you want to find something right real quickly, find it. You gotta really get around and find something. Go to the special button or whatever to get information. Uh, that'd be nice if we do that easier. Is there any volunteers or anybody that we knew that was around? Scott well, that goes up. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know, I, I come back. I I would say this. So I went to the to the Chamber of Commerce and, and we made a decision, and I'm not second guessing. But I went to the Chamber of Commerce meeting um, um, dinner, and um, the gentleman from um, that, that built their website. Was there yeah, and, and, yeah, and and you know he was passionate about the community and stuff like that. And you know one of the things that when we were making the decision for using this company was this company was offering something that was yeah. going to be different from what he can offer, but 
my point is exactly what I keep trying to say. He was passionate. He came down to the chamber of commerce. Not that okay. we made the wrong decision. Okay. But what okay. I'm saying is when you have passionate people that take a passion, you're not paying them. They're taking a passion there because they're wanting to be there. That's, in my opinion, is maybe somebody that we need to try to locate for the, the uh, obviously, you know, up in the paid and clerk, uh, it, uh, is obviously something where I think it should come from. But if you had somebody that was passionate about that, that understood that type of stuff, that could be something that they could work on and try to clean it up and would probably like to spend less time. They want you would be trying to learn it. But I don't, I don't know of any folks. I'm here to make a list because I started looking at it. I made some things, mm -hmm. but you need to basically open up every menu mm -hmm. and every uh, sub menu on there to see what's underneath them. Yeah. Uh, and that just takes a lot. I mean, just in an hour, I came up with five or six different things. Mm -hmm. And I didn't open up everything. I just got figured I spent enough time looking at it. You know, I was, I mean, I can send you this short list I made. Send me the short list. Well, it just gives me an idea. When when do you anticipate the town clerk being able to fit some of this in? I've been like months without a clerk. Right. I'm going to be clear that some of the editing and legal requirements are the highest priority for me. Some of the pros are lower than getting minutes up, than getting agendas up, than getting our bookkeeping up. And then some of it, I have not touched the website with them yet. So I don't know how, how comfortable they'll be swimming into that. Feel comfortable about the bookkeeping mm -hmm. right now, but that's the first thing that I had on my mind to get off of my hours. I can start editing at it slowly and chipping away at it. If it feels like it's that comprehensive editing, then it's like what, it's like what Scott said, that you just go through the pages and do it like that. If it was something more high level, like, hey, I want this format change or something bigger direction like that, that could be included in the list, but there's no purpose in somebody sending a list where we, we flipped an I and an E. That just, like Scott said, is just careful eye on a page and then copy editing. That's copy editing. Mm -hmm. I could start copy editing on it. Was the town in general, I mean, was town council in general satisfied with the way? I don't know if they didn't use it much. I think a lot of these people use the Facebook thing. I don't know if anybody's actually used it much to talk about it. I'm not afraid to talk about it. It's just kind of something I do, but I agree. Maybe you got the wrong people. Maybe you should have that. No, I, I, you made a decision and stuck with it. I mean, yeah, exactly. yeah. I think we need to yeah. follow up and get it to where it needs to this is be. Yeah, but, but, <laughs> we need to go local. We the website I'm supposed to be doing a lot more than it's doing right now. It's part of the reason we went down that path. And a big part of it was also to be able to get all our um, yes. ordinances and all our yeah. code and everything yeah. out there. And, the searchability yeah. and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. So the, the I know it's not a priority for Javier, but the one of the priorities for us spending sixty five hundred dollars to be able to have someone redo the website was that so if someone came into town, they could find things. If yeah. someone wanted to find maps, they could find things. Yeah. If someone wanted to know when the meetings are, they could find things. These that was the priority. I know it's not your priority. But that was the reason that the good. town council spent sixty five hundred dollars and said we're redoing this because yeah. the other one couldn't do it at all. Um, so yeah, this website's a major change yeah. from the last one. So yeah. shipping at it and it's maintenance now. Yeah. But I've had a clerk in since last Monday, so yeah. Right it's, now it's just getting there. Uh, um, to me, it's more than maintenance because so much of the stuff has not been mm -hmm. really updated and moved on to it. Once it's moved on to it, then you can say any new agenda item, new minutes uh, to the calendars and stuff like that. Then I consider maintenance. But this is actually still building it out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, still building it out. But still working with it. But I agree with you. Part of it was they were going to be able to put the up-to-date code on it so that it could be searched and 
um, which was a big. So if someone on the planning board wanted to know every document that had the word sidewalk in it, they could find it. Yes. And I got the feeling that it probably doesn't have that here for the woods. Or yeah. capacity. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I was looking at this week, <laughs> which was a little bit concerning. Um, I was looking for minutes, uh, I mean, from like a year ago. Let's figure out how to get the minutes from a year ago. The yeah. town council minutes are there. Oh, yeah. I was looking for, really, for a year. Yeah. 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 Just go back in ways. I don't know if you're just listening. I saw some of that. This is really, I don't know. Like it's, what I can do is yeah, really piece by piece yeah. start working on that. Mm -hmm. And that's the that's the feasible while holding on to a lot of the priorities I have yeah. here. Yeah. 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 Anything else? Can, can they bring it up to can you bring it up to town council? The about, yeah, 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 sure. About that and, 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 and about what's the, I mean, what specifically to bring it up? Well, you can just say that it, it's not okay. The not, website's still being, uh, I think, yeah. what yeah. the general rule of thumb was from everybody here was that it's not functioning it as it, yeah. you know, the general idea was that it was going to be functioning it as, and maybe a plan to get that up to speed over time, or at least in if we're talking about. Three months or two months or something. Well, the question is, can, can it be brought up? Can it be brought up for speed or you know? So it was our understanding what searchability, because we then got cut out of that communication, was our understanding of searchability, not what they were uh sending to I think you know, you know right. what I mean? Right. So it may be the fact that you just can't do that, right. but that's why that's what got the contract. Right. That was a major reason, it was a major difference between the other gentleman and this one. Was the ability to search it and the ability for it to be constantly kept up to date so that it wouldn't meet all the federal regulations and et cetera. That was, that was a major part of it. And right. it's not there. So, you know, I feel like we paid for something and didn't get it. We paid instead, we paid, we paid for phase one and how much is going to cost for phase two and yeah. how much is it going to cost for phase three. And maybe that gentleman that put in. An eighty thousand dollar offer was probably accurate. I don't know, mm -hmm. but we certainly don't have that ability, you know, as a town to spend eighty thousand dollars on the website. So mm -hmm. I think we need to get clarity on what they're really supposed to be doing. Are they doing what they contracted to us, or they're they just hoping we yeah. notice that they're doing? You know, that I think is really important. I mean, one example, the thing that is a way of search when I on my, my computer, right? Pull up all the files on Windows. Yeah. There's a little bar in there, and I can search, and it will eventually come out with. If I put a word in there, it'll come out with every place in the yeah. hundreds of files that word is. Right. And our website doesn't do yeah. that. And I, that's what we thought it would do. Yeah. 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 So, in some ways, I feel like we can solve the bill of sales, but maybe it's just someone needs to push back and they can do what they said they were, or did we, or, they, or, or was it communicated not to our group, but to, I mean, that it wasn't, you know, I don't know, yeah, no. you know, we don't know, and we were all the ones saying we're not techno, yeah. you know, that, that wasn't our field, I think the same as it was, and that's why it she kind of took the long way into it, but bottom line is, did we get what we contracted for or not? Because it's certainly not what we thought it would be. And it's certainly not searchable. And it's certainly not everything we thought it would be. So. Can you bring that up at town council? I mean, it's, I think that's, 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 that's yeah. the question that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think maintenance just comes back to you know, the performance is unacceptable and you got to do about it. And this is just what we keep saying. Yeah. The maintenance says it's unacceptable what's been going on. What do you need to do about it? It's up to council. Yeah. Truly is. The council yeah, thinks the town looks great yeah, and the town looks great. Yeah. They can. They can take care of it. They can instruct. Yeah. They can certainly yeah. take care of it. They can correct it. Yeah. yeah. It was important enough. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, we said that. Uh, we did it. We corrected it. 
Yeah. 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 Planning committee votes at the uh, Parks and Rec committee. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And, yeah, we've got to yeah. have a meeting next week with the Parks and Rec. We have several people that are just going to be on the committee. That's next Wednesday for the shift that organizational because we don't have a, I'm not the liaison, but uh, we do need to get committee members and, and just got to get contacts and stuff. So we're going to be at next Wednesday. We're going to get a No, I was just going to say the council still needs to be there. A point of liaison so that you can start having meetings yeah. and we can start moving forward. Um, but you were saying you wanted to get some contacts, yeah. And the scans that makes sense. sense. So, um, if you know anybody's interested in our scan and also with the, the hiking club, some of them might be interested. Uh, but you've sent, Javier, mean, you sent stuff out to people, haven't you, to those organizations? Yeah, about the parks committee. Yeah. I mean, our bill, Bill, did yeah, yeah, oh, Bill, did yeah, okay, and I already contacted okay. them. Of, um, and I also told them, yes, anybody who wants to be at it, or, it's just more of a, a general meeting. It's a meeting where you get it. This would be the contact. So, yeah, so it's, it's been brought back. It'd be nice to have, I don't know how you do an announcement on the website, but maybe you can put an announcement on it. Who, who, the Parks and Rec Committee, what, what was What's good? What's the point of it? Yeah, what was the general? Well, basically, I think it's mostly for a but it's really, uh, it, it's don't you have what you wrote up? I don't have it here, but I we can just send it. Much more. Yeah, yeah, I can send it to you, but it's basically you know, uh, but it's basically um, you know, maintenance and uh, if we did it uh, all the park. But I think the front and the most of that fleet, mm -hmm. you know, to take that, you know, the key, uh, you know, trails and the, you know, uh, and, and I think I and I wrote something about the first thing is, is to get some uh some rules for the park, I think, and also some maps, mm -hmm. you know, because we all got some maps for that other, or maybe I'm not sure if people you want to do, we have a big map like like other parks who have a little full level to pick up, mm -hmm. but we need maps and rules, I think, for that, and then uh. Some people are interested in actually doing some maintenance. And they're actually doing some maintenance of scan this weekend. So I'm gonna try to go out there and talk to them a little bit. Um, you know, I think the trails are not that. I mean, they need some work. Mm -hmm. But um, you know, they're basically picking up sticks and you know, like, there's a couple of trees down, but for the most part, they're not bad. Right. Get the the main, you know, the thing is, so this is about this so that people don't go out there and make their own trails, you know. Okay. So the idea is, is like the rules and yeah, and rules and maps and and, 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 yeah. and maintenance of yeah. it. So it'll be like your your I'm assuming your vision sort of like a, uh the Appalachian Trail, um, you know that that gets yeah perpetually maintained yeah. by groups. Yeah. So, so your, yeah. your idea is that this group would yeah. do something that would just yeah, go the same. I mean, well, we could do some of it. I mean, that's the thing I put in there during the winter. We could do some of it in a lot. We could do a lot of it. But uh, what was what because was, he got a chainsaw? Who, who is doing? Um, and and I'm bringing this up because of the historical concept. Fifteen Creek did not have trails there years ago. When my kids were small, I know we yeah. had a we had a day where we went out um, and and sort of started um, cutting loose trails through. So is that something that that was part of it. I was part of it. I was part of it. I was I was part of it. 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 I was do the trails mm -hmm. and then the parks and rec have gone through a point from the storm and they've cut the uh, logs off the trails. Mm -hmm. so, and it's parks and rec with yeah. having oh, right. they they the, the paid folk for Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. And it's a paid maintenance group in the parks and rec. So they'll come in afterwards and and, yeah. and, and that trail is pretty much That's great. always and accessible. It, I've been with 
Yeah, you know, I keep up with the They made a few bridges. Yeah, right. We just yeah, had I mean, it was a few areas, areas that were yeah. just, yeah, didn't have bridges. We just yeah. had this. It's so, yeah. Yeah. they made a few. I mean, they're not, or the, no, no, no. They're not yeah. they're fancy. Yeah. Just a few, few yeah. lots of swaying yeah. across. Yeah. So what, what was they going to pull stuff? And then, you know, once people, once you made the trail, um, people start walking on that will actually keep them going because you know um get rid of the grass and stuff it's just walking on them. Right. Well and, and the reason I bring that up is you know I just remember that it was nothing. Yeah, and then we yeah. had something. Yeah. And you know what I always say is we're not talking about Toe Tree Creek trails anymore. So, which comes back to exactly what I'm trying to tell you is you sort of put something in place to where it yeah. you start with it and it and it continues and you know we then we you know we're we're not talking about Toe Tree Creek and that hasn't been that long ago twenty years ago my kids were probably about ten years ago no it was yeah maybe maybe it was twelve. Like yeah. Ellie was eight and kids yeah. or maybe six or something, but they were they were young. But again, we're not talking about that. Yeah. They, Anything that we do should be exactly like that. Yeah. And yeah. they um I think it started, they had a just a general announcement or something, one side and if you're interested, go down there. And then we got a bunch of them. A bunch came down there. And then basically in some group of that, it's the one who started working on it. So they just one day they just did a little bit the first bit along the mm -hmm. river or the oh, reservoir. Yeah. And then the next time we petered out to basically four or five of us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was James was unemployed for about four months. I went out every week and a couple of performers did it. And, yeah. But and it didn't take once you get it done, you know, it's you're done. Right? <laughs> but he flagged it where, where it should be. It's really that right. hard to do it as long as you uh, Cut down the trees and get some trail right from them. Yeah. And they're doing the same thing this, uh, this Saturday at, at Scan mm -hmm. a little bit. They're going to be doing some trail there. I don't think it would be that hard. They're, you know, they got a group coming for that. So, right. Well, it comes back down to the maintenance yeah. part of that because yeah. one of the things you're, you know, we're sort of creating this and, yeah. and you know, it comes back down to once it's done, then, yeah. you know, you know, one, you want, People to obviously want people to use yeah. it to, to to keep the leaves yeah. out per se, but yeah. you also want you know it, it, it may be a maintenance thing or yeah, where a maintenance thing, you know periodically go down there cut anything that's fallen down yeah. and any bushes and stuff that comes in it makes the trail hard to get by. And yeah. It's not a frequent thing; it's like twice a year, yeah. Yeah, twice a year. Yeah. But that that's sort of like a town maintenance. Yeah, that's part of it. I mean, yeah, that, you know, that comes back down yeah. to what we're talking about because the whole point of the whole point of getting beyond stuff is to get a firm base on the first thing before you go to the yeah. next, the second thing, or else you're planning for it to not succeed. And I, I just can't stand failure. I really can't. Yeah. That irritates me. Um, so when you know, I, I would say from Parks and Rec, one of the things I look at is, you know. You've got the sports leagues up here, which I know may not be yeah. part of what you know the town's situation is, but I also think it's important that you know potentially they, in some respects, um, be offered an invitation, you know, as far as to be part of it, or yeah. you know, that's another thing that the, yeah. the, the Sox League yeah, is something about us. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's just that that's part of it that builds a community yeah. you know you got the trails we get that is yeah. that is, you know and i've said before you go down there and you see on seven saturdays you know you see all the kids come down and 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 they're, and they're participating in it and you know you have the kids from you know a young age to where you know these kids then get out and hike they go over the trail um you know that's part of the community part and i and i think that that you know should maybe be something yeah that is and, yeah, you know, start with the trails, yeah. but maybe it could be expanded. One of the things that we probably talked a little bit about was, was looking at you know, people to maybe to, to expand the trail at the uh, wetland area. They have a little trail there, and they have a wetland area trail. Um, and also, maybe you do something with canal basis for it. You know, that's kind of a part, too. That's really, I think, 
more maintenance than anything. But uh, if the wetlands could be a trick, and there's a, there's also talk about having trails or parks that the uh, where the thirty six thousand are going to go, just put them a park there. But you know that's down the road too. But I don't know if that could be town or the. Well, that's almost I think it's association, but I think I think one of the agreements is that the town can go in there, right? They can go. Yeah, that's what you guys thought, but that's not what you have. Really? Yeah, I thought it was part of the, nope. the deal. No, nope. according to the no. app, the, uh, what they agreed to do was they were going to put in a wood chip uh, uh, trail down to the pond, not around the pond, because the pond's in another uh, tax map. And they were going to give it to the town so the town would become public land and the town would have to maintain it. Uh, and that's, that's, that's not something the town uh, Okay. Well, so, so that, that may be an understanding, but it isn't yeah. that wasn't right. Well, right. So the park might just be those two parks, the wetlands and the land, I guess. And, and then when you get into the, the wetlands, wetland. you have to be careful about touching those wetlands. Right. Like no. Yeah. Just because you have the, the land use, you're right. still dealing with the wetland. Right. Do you know that the regulatory commission yeah. that's in I don't I wasn't it's not the OJ, it was, yeah. you know, it's yeah. you know, something right. right. Mm -hmm. But before you do anything, you gotta talk to them. Yeah. You know, you can't just have people going in there and putting yeah. that down. Yes, the wetlands yes. are yes. the yes. are the trees taking the water down. Yeah. You, know, yeah. you gotta be careful about that. You know, someone with knowledge has to be able to do yeah. that. But I think too, we're speaking about because we went down a different path. Part of the reason for the parks and rec committee is the, the same thing as when Greg came here, he had a frustration of who do I go to when I need something? Who do I go to when I need to report? Who and the Parks and Rec Committee, the big thing is it's it's the person to contact. You know, someone saying there's a tree down, who do I tell? Right. You, know, you tell the contact at the committee. Yeah. How do we get this fixed? The contact with yeah. the other committee. So I think that's a big part of it right now. You've got people floating around doing things independently or not. And someone going down and hacking trees in our wetland can get us in a lot of trouble. Yeah. And not intentionally, but mm -hmm. you know, yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of times. Right. But man, I think the main point is who's in charge of it and what's the contact. Right. So if I do want to volunteer, if I do want to get involved, yeah. if I have a great idea and I want parts and rent to get involved, they know where to go. Yeah. Like, yes, this is going to be very limited in the way trail in the wet lanes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I can't imagine. Yeah, that'll be very interesting. Yeah, new trails. Yeah, I don't believe there's going to be much of anything that's going to be allowed to do. Yeah, I don't. Is it, is but, it, but one of the things they want to well, place the fact that Dr. Wood, well, she's like a picnic table there, a very good day, but middle of the town. And they don't think we should take that away from us. It could, you know, if there's a solid area that's not in what lanes, it's not that they can yeah. do that. Yeah. But it's not very little about to be able to do. The other thing about this is just to be sort of the apartment experience with that, too. So, you know, we haven't figured out. I mean, it was so people had to go there. Part of, it. That's uh, part of the agreement. Right? That was part of the weird part of the agreement was that um, the owner of the property said, Yes, you can use the parking lot, yes. but I have the right to take it away at any time. And if Echelon said, Develop, that's the first thing they're doing is taking that parking away. So we kind of have it, but we don't. Well, we did have it. Uh -uh. No, that wasn't the agreement. It's yeah. not the way the contract was written. It was a bit would be nice to have a part of that was I, don't I get it. That's the way it was pitched, but that's not what the written contract was. Yeah. So good. Well, it wasn't for the town, was it? I think the, that the, was the wetlands. I think yeah, I, I think it was for the town. But it was for it was for people going to the wetlands, which is for the public. Yeah, I think they've got four spaces there. What do you want to try that? I don't know about the parking, but I mean I think some of it some of that. Whole wetland park was because of the potential development being yeah. uh, in the common area nearby that. Well, we actually have a chance for that. Well, uh, and, and, and you said, well, there was something that the town sort of put up there because we forget where it But I mean, so it, it's going to be a town park. It can be a town park, but right? so that's part of the idea of the park. It's time for the right to use it. Yeah, as a park. Is that what just the way? Yeah. 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 yeah, and you guys, the town rezoned the property, so it was public land. And it wasn't for it was what it's called. So it's called. And it's, but it's, it's not public land, too, right? Or no one. Yeah. It's shared. Yeah. I mean, it's yeah. Public, pop, it, if it's zoned public, correct me if I'm wrong, um, Javier, if a piece of property is zoned public, then it's access gate, it's town land. You don't land. own it. Yeah. But that's the zone. Once it becomes public, so like if and 
I'm not saying it's going to happen. If Bird Street put in a trail down to the pond and said the town can have it, it would have to be rezoned public and then everyone can have access to it. Uh -huh. And then the town has to maintain it and the town has to bring it up to 80 uh -huh. specs and all that kind of stuff. That's our liability. Right. Uh, yeah. yeah, that's why it's not going to be. That's why it's probably going to happen. Yeah, but, but that wasn't the deal people thought, but that is crap. Uh, it wouldn't have been wetlands. The wetlands can be, uh, can be oh, oh, no. oh, oh, it is a liability. We, we paid $80,000 to take that liability out. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, you'll be paying rights for that. Yeah. yeah. You'll be paying rights for that. I don't know if we bought, the, I thought we bought the money. Is that true? And then we bought it out. Just one place. That's right. The bike right yeah, now. That's right. We did not. So he did not offer so that maintenance. Uh, you don't have to do anything with it, but it's you have the land use. No. That's all that was part of that deal. Right. And that was part of the argument why it wasn't such a great deal because if he ever had needed open green space, he could still use that, even though we would be maintaining it and everything else. But at this point, it's probably new. You know, it's, it doesn't matter. We, we, Contract it out and we pay for it, and we can get an endowment to put money into it and being able to put in boardwalks and everything that people are talking about. My point was that that wetlands, and someone needs to check it out, I can be very wrong, but you just don't go into a wetland right. without getting yeah. approval. I do not remember right. the name of the agency. I know that. Right. And I don't know if because it became a public, does it no longer be a wetland? And I doubt that. Wetland serves a purpose, so it's always a wetland. I think you know, it's going to stay in the wetland. But what I mean, I don't think I don't think the town can also say that's not a wetland. Well, do we have an expert here in town? I mean, what are these folks what? over here? Uh, well, I know what you're talking about. It may be. Green. Oh, the green. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but that this guy, this is a big store. But again, I don't know the agency. Yeah. 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 Head, but there is an agency in charge of yeah. that, and they take it very serious. Yeah. And like I said, someone going in and cutting trees down can get you in a lot of trouble. Yeah. Yeah. A lot. Yeah. Well, my point was very good. So they don't have any explanation. Oh, that'd be halfway around the world. Just halfway? Yes. What? Far enough, right? Because we're going to remain closer. It's a phase from Hong Kong to Bali. So it's not, it's not literally, it's figuratively, we'll be halfway around the world. Wow. I, I, I had one question. Um, real estate tax. As far as can that be something that we put on a, like an agenda that we talk about? Mm -hmm. Real estate tax. Yeah, we could. I know there's some good ones, but I think it's a uh, crucial thing. At least it would be interesting to find out what the numbers are. Oh, you know, what, what, what it would be. How much would bring it on without costing the town a lot of money or, or a lot of headache? You know, what, what, what it could be that. I think there was something said, no, we used to do some of these years ago with different scenarios, but it was this much, this much, this much. So, well, there's a difference between how the law and how the law on how the real estate taxes are collected. Oh, yes. Yeah. I remember the man saying that. Yeah. And, that's one of the reasons. I mean, I think I actually think the a number of strategic things that would be interesting but it becomes more difficult to do a real estate tax here because of those differences. Yeah. Uh, it's it's added on to Alamore, too. What? It's, it's added on to Alamore and it's added on to Havana. I mean, who collects it and disperses it? I think Alamore would collect it from people in Alamore, from people in Havana. I'm not sure how that happens. Um, Are you the same as sales tax? Because we're going to have to the sales tax and it doesn't look like I'm all the same. Okay. One scenario I remember Matt gave is that we would try to pay 
an amount to kind of get included on the real estate tax so that we would be in their process and then we would get that monthly back if it was on top. So kind of plugging into their system that they use. Yeah. I think you mentioned it even at this government service meeting like a year and a half ago. Yeah. Or, or we would actually we'd plug into it. Yeah. Get the money back. But it's yeah. uh they'll they'll charge us to do yeah. that. And, uh, yeah, it's administrative. Yeah, wasn't yeah. it the your ten cents on the hundred was a break even? That was the amount, but that didn't include that administrative fee, which I remember was a so, that's what I mean. That's a name that yeah. The number that's being thrown around is like we can charge this, they can collect it, but we still don't get anything out of it, right? You know, something like that. I think it was 10 cents on 100. So it was he had some break amount, even. Yeah, he had some amount that he was figuring out that was break even. And yeah. then, and so when they talk about like the $300, you know, per household, that's just collecting money to get that online. Because you have to do 50 or 75 cents on the 100. So, Which I don't quite understand that process as yeah. far as how, how they did it. And I guess that's where I'm, I'm sort of questioning. I, yeah. I, I had a conversation with the Orange, with the Mission Revenue there. And what she said, um, she said, we supply the information mm -hmm. and then all they have to do is bill for it. They, you know, Town of Gordon's bill, Bill's independent, and Town of, town of um, um, orange bills and things. they just provide the documentation and she said i mean yes you you, you know you send out however many yeah, yeah. orange the, the town keeps their own taxes thus yeah. they collect their own taxes Elmar yeah. county is collecting all the property taxes because it's theirs yeah. and so we're in that same system so they would need to collect it and reimburse us just like don't we do that no. with some no, 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 no. Uh, licensing and all that kind of stuff. I'm just saying Orange County and, and Almore County may not be apples to apples. Is what I'm that's, that's, exactly. But that but does it have to be? Does no. that, so since when you, you could if, have if a, we're a town. You could have an office of revenue in Scottsville and then they could be dedicated to any kind of tax. So for example, that's what they're doing with the town of Scott or with the town of Orange, I'm assuming. Well, they just, they just provide the assessment. Yeah. You know, the, the assessment. The data. assessment, but then you have a department of taxation. Like, you want, do you want to take on the administrative mm -hmm. responsibility? Okay. So, 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 so they yeah. right. sending out the bills, collecting them. And or you just so try to piggyback on there. There's everything you're about to collect is just going to go to pay for the guy to collect it instead mm -hmm. of paying out more to collect it. But that's yeah. so uh, I'm not, no, 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 no. But I'm this is this is why the Army all is saying. I don't know if I, it'd be worth exploring it to me because I mean I remember years ago, um, you used to pay the trash. Service. Yeah, right. I mean okay. that yeah. that that was fun. Each each individual. Uh, was you know paid yeah. and, and 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 now we have, what, did you individually pay it? Yeah, we're going to do to, to, gonna do to the, the trash the, to the town each month, okay. or was it? No, we know it's not. I'm going to ask George Bill what he would look yeah. to pay. I'm and just how that works. But we had a deal, and we had a we had a bulk cleanup every year or two. You know, what you for your refrigerators or whatever, and they would pick that up. But uh, I know I've seen them in the landfill. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. So it's do you do it yourself or do you get somebody else to do it? And then to Matt's point, it's uh you could spend money both ways. But well, we spend money on maintenance now, yeah. and we get absolutely nothing. Yeah. Right? And, yeah. and 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 everybody's okay with it and sees no it's problem. So you know, all right. So, so so the idea of you know the, the town tax is just another type. I mean, I'm I'm not looking at it, I'm just I'm just inquiring. It could yeah. be that we explore this and it and, and it makes no sense but i i just what i learned is i don't always trust what i don't know when i try to go out and find the answers and um is it something where you know you, you know i could maybe bring it up and yeah. just discuss a little bit about okay. it uh because it, there's been it's interesting some people get more revenue with the town somehow and that was one of the ways to the other way i, I don't know if we see one from the to do this but to look at you know is there grants that we can explore that are out there? Is there a book of grants that we can look at? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I just don't like the idea of looking at grants. And, and let me explain. Let me explain one thing. You know, I was looking at doing this project up on top of the hill there. 
All right. That's money. There's always a, already a lot of debt that's in play. Right. All right. So if we talk about the maintenance side of stuff, I mean, again, that's going to bring people into the town. Right. That's, you know, I'm not saying we can't look at grants. I'm just like, that's something to where from the maintenance side of everything, up, if, if everything was nice and appealing and cute, um, I just think that's a place to start. And, and, and you know, if you, if, if I did three of them eventually, I mean, that could be a little bit of revenue that would be coming into the town. I, I, I just think it needs to be a mutual, um, beneficial relationship with all the stakeholders yeah. that are that are in, in, in place. And, you know, the grant, who got a grant? Didn't we get a grant for the wetland? Um, uh, yes, you know, so, so we got something and that technically could still keep taking away. Um, with the liability side, you know, so it was, it was good, it was really, but you know, it, 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 I don't know. I, yeah. I'm just, just big on trying to do what we have, what yeah. we have. and I bring it up just because it, that sort of comes back to the point. And I don't look at it from the real estate tax. Yeah. The, the, the whole point of the real estate tax is not to fund the, the, the town by the residents. That's not why I want to look at it. I want to look at it from the standpoint of the fact that you know that you're talking about development coming in and you know nobody has done any type of analysis of that was like you know we're gonna potentially have 36 new homes up here and well you know but but we have already 36 approved right. there is, is that going to increase the workload on our, our you know i mean i just don't think you can have an unlimited amount of population without really looking at the revenue side and i think that i think not exploring it before that happens is not the right is not the right way i don't think that decision i think that's yeah. operating from behind and i don't know i i, I, I can be <laughs> brought into that but i just don't like that mindset I, I would like to say going in that hey this is going to be at a cost so when you talk about grants i mean i, I don't know is there do they have grants to look at towns that have not had taxes before? And I mean, yeah, it, I mean again, I'm just asking rhetorical questions. I'm not expecting an answer, but but I just think it should be explored further. Yeah. Uh, I do think when we talk about revenue, you know, the comment about how the Lord is going to take a certain amount, you know, I don't think people are thinking of that. No. I think it's just us, but it's 10 cents on a We'll, we'll get the 10 cents on 100 evaluation in the old, depending on what they take. But would, is that really the way it works? Would they not just send us the information? Well, Javier would have to know because he was involved with it with uh, Matt. I know Matt he did kind of explored all that too. Yeah. But from, what, know, from the way he described it, it's, you could be provided that information, then you'd pay that administrative fee. So they set up. That they're collecting and they're collecting in this area and then send it over to us and then we take on some of the administrative burden with staff members mm -hmm. and then there could be something more where it's us look more hands off mm -hmm. but i think that's a moving target and i don't feel comfortable looking at it until i see what matt was exactly discussing um, yeah. that was right when i started here um, so he was touching mostly budget I'm pretty sure it's a 10 cents on the 100, which was pretty key. Pretty key. So we, and, and that's been presented to town council multiple times. That's been presented to planning board multiple times. We've discussed it at government services multiple times. Yeah. But it's interesting when you hear council saying we can do 10 cents on the dollar and we're bringing 300 per household. And it's not true. Mm -hmm. you know, so that's the hard part. You know. Um, if they're really going to move forward with it, they have to know what they're talking about. Because it's, you know, I have people coming up to me and I'm like, no, well, that's not going to do anything, but okay. Right. Yeah. 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 But that's been, well, we haven't talked about that government service because we really have been talking about the property tax a long time. It was actually brought up by Matt. As a matter of fact, we were sitting over there, and I remember he was sitting right opposite me. And we were going over the budget, and we were going over 
all the things that you could tax and alcohol or whatever it was and cigarettes and food tax and you kept pushing this is the one tax we're not taking advantage of is the town tax and that's when you went through the numbers and that's when you went through 10 cents on 100 that's when you went through roughly 300 you know and roughly very roughly 330 dollars per household but that was just to break even. Uh, but he did review that with us like I said, we were over there. I don't know why. The tables were all shifted. And everything. I don't remember that. But he was pretty adamant. This we, we had to take advantage of it. I know we haven't taken advantage of it. Yes. But it was a budget. It was more through budget. Yeah. That's yeah. when he actually went through the numbers. But he's also presented it to council for the same reason. You know, and I, at the time, I was going to meetings. And I remember it at the meetings, too. I'm, I remember talking about it. I just don't know. I saw his feasibility study for the thing up here. We didn't see any. Yeah. No, the one that he pre presented. I get it. <laughs> you know, we, didn't, we didn't see anything. We didn't see anything on that. Right. And that's that's where I would maybe like to explore it a little bit further. Mm -hmm. see. Okay. 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 Thank you. 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 Thank